Hey guys, Sock here from Sock e Ticket. In today's video, what we have is we have a brand new software update waiting for our Samsung Galaxy smartphones. We also have another update. So let's dive in and talk about both of them. So first one is the regular update. A software update is now available. If I go down over here, if I go to software update, tap on download and install, you are gonna see that we have the January 1st security patch. The size of this update is 241 megabytes. So we are gonna run this, talk about what's happening. Now let's go back and look at the other update. Now the other update that we have actually updates the device care menu right over here. Now this new update to the device care seems to have fixed the battery problem that we were having in the battery module where this was not working properly right over here. So as you can see, mine is not working properly. So that has been resolved with the update as well. Now to update device care to the latest version, all you wanna do is click the link down below, okay? It's gonna take you to my website, and then you're gonna swipe down just a little bit. Under download, you are gonna click the link. Once you click the link, it is gonna take you to the actual store. Once you're at the store, you simply tap on update, and that's gonna update your device care to the latest version. If you do not see the update, that means your device care is in fact up to date. And you can see the new version is 12.0.01.0, updated on January the 4th. This update simply enhances the performance of the device care. Now let's go back over here and do the actual software update that's available. So again, I'm gonna go down here, I'm gonna tap on this guy, and I'm gonna tap on install now. Okay, I'm gonna be right back once this is in fact done. All right, so we are back. If I pull this down, you'll see that we are in fact finishing the system update. So that's great. All right, so it is in fact complete. Now real quick, I do wanna let you know, this is One UI 3.0. This is the first update for 2021. It gets you the latest security patch. And if you look over here, uh, if I go to the settings over here, if I go to my software information and go to last update, it does give me some device stability improvements, some bug fixes. It says new and or enhanced features. I have not seen any new features uh, with this update so far, but it also improves the performance a little bit. And I'll let you know right away, One UI 3.0 on this phone, on the Note 20 Ultra, does feel now a little bit more stable. Things feel a little bit more smoother and more responsive, and that's gonna continue happening as we get more and more updates. And if you wanna get the details of what you got, what kind of security fixes were done with this update, all you wanna do is go to your settings, okay, and then you go into your uh, about phone, and then you tap on software information, and you go all the way down, and you tap, or look over here, it says Android security patch level the first, which is great, that's what you want, 2021. You click on this, it'll take you to a website, and basically from here, you can go into individual manufacturers, such as Samsung, and that will they will give you a breakdown of what security loopholes were in fact addressed with this update. So I do want to let you know these updates are not for nothing. They are in fact very important. They patch important information. So you can see them over here, read if you want to, if you are into these things. All right, uh, but that's basically it with the device care that was applied to all Samsung phones. Uh, if I do go in here, uh, again, there is not a new feature in here with the latest update but it now works even better. I got a couple of messages from people letting me know that their device care, people that spend a lot of time in device care were able to tell that it's running a little bit better. Let me tap on optimize, let's see what happens. Okay, works as usual, but apparently it's now even faster than usual. One problem we were having, we were having a problem with this area here, which was blanked out that seems to have been patched as well. Anyway, guys, for now, have a fantastic day. If you have any questions, comments, or concerns, drop them down below. All right, so if you found this video useful, make sure to subscribe to Saki Tech by clicking that button, and also click that bell icon on the side to make sure you get notified every time I upload a new video. And if you do use Twitter, Instagram, or Facebook, you can follow me at Saki Tech Online to get the latest updates as well. All right, have a fantastic day.